Hey gang, I want to show you guys how to properly swing E-Box at the start of the round. So let's say you uh, have an op, or even a rifle, uh, and you have a good spawn here in CT. So what you want to do is run from spawn, come over here through CT like this, go to the right side of default, you don't want to go to the left side. Um, as far as I know, it's about the same speed, but it's a little easier to throw the nades if you go to the right. So what you want to do is pull out a flash first, and you're going to throw once you get to these stairs. Uh, let me show you the uh, CT smoke real quick. So the uh, smoke, the or sorry, the T smoke, the smoke they usually throw lands right around here. So that's gonna be smoke like that. So you're gonna have a flash out as you come around the right side of default. You're gonna let go right as you get about to the stairs. You want to aim kind of low right here. Um, you'll notice this mark here. It's always gonna be a little bit to the right. So this smoke kind of obscures where you want to aim. It's a helpful guiding point. So let's let this smoke fade, and I'm gonna show you where you want to aim. So you want to aim kind of low, right in the middle here. If you aim too high, sometimes the flash will go too far in here. Uh, and it's more likely to get blocked by this like ledge uh, on, in canals. So you want to aim kind of low so that it bounces like that. So that flash is going to blind someone playing here. It's not going to blind this angle usually. But it is going to blind this angle and this angle. So the main angle to worry about is going to be here because he's not going to be flashed. Um, just FYI. And then, so you're going to throw that flash once you get to stairs, aiming low. And then right after that, you're going to throw an HE to pop the smoke, so the smoke's going to be here. You're going to go basically a little bit behind the smoke, just kind of like right here, and you're going to aim a little bit above the smoke, and you're going to right-click. You're going to back up, zoom in. So what I want you to do is throw the smoke, and then you're going to quickly back into this corner, and you're going to zoom in, and you're going to be trying to look... At this angle right here that doesn't get blind by the flash, that's the first place you're probably going to look, and then you're going to look for someone running up close. Um, and that's kind of how you quickly, at the start of the round, if, it's even better if you have an op, because you can really easily kill this guy if he's trying to op hold it. Um, just FYI, also FYI, the uh, tease, if he is playing this angle, more than likely he's going to be looking like this. It's kind of hard to see all the way in over here. If he is playing like this, kind of tucked in, because there's a little bit of a cubby here right so you have a, a much better angle here especially because he's probably going to be looking here as well um so what that's going to look like at full speed here so let me show you real quick what the t's usually want to do so they usually come to this green door here and they're going to throw this smoke fyi if you didn't know how to smoke uh, e-box from spawn you can go to that door jumping left click it's going to land right there that's usually the smoke they throw so CT, CT side, assuming you have a good e-box spawn, you're going to come over here through CT. You're going to come to the right side of default. You're going to run and left click like that. And then you're going to pull your nade out. Come next to the smoke. Right, Aim up a little bit. Right click. Get in this corner. Not there. All right, look here. And then you're out. And that's how you can quickly go for an e-box uh, swing and a pick or info at the start of the round, guys. And I hope this video helps you out. And as always, easy peasy.